Lolly Ho! Dipper here, and I'm gonna be doing an anime reaction of popular anime openings. If you have any suggestions, please leave in the comments below. But for starters, we're gonna go with JoJo's Bizarre Adventures. I've never watched this anime. <laughs> so I'll be watching all of the openings of JoJo's Bizarre Adventures and see if that convinces me to actually take the time to watch this anime. Big shout out to Polomen for putting together all of the openings in one video. Thank you! Comic to anime style. I love it. They've been doing that a lot lately. Um, they've added that into Spider-Man movies lately. Been loving those, by the way. Okay, so we got blonde versus blue hair, dude. So that's gonna be like, what, our Naruto and our Sasuke? Oh, there's a girl involved. Oh, there's always some girl, I guess, involved. <laughs> Okay, the love story. She's not happy with the yellow hair. Or just shock, I don't know. Okay. So everyone is like super powerful, I can get that. Music's banging though. Super powered, okay. I I do like watching anime, action anime that that where superpowers involved. If they can get the uh, anime fights executed well, it's it's one of the coolest clips to watch. <laughs> well, he's heated. Oh, definite villain vibe. Yeah, no, definitely. Okay, so this is the villain. He's a villain. So what, does he like take the girl or something? Is the blue hair man trying to get his girl back or something? Yeah. They're definitely opposing each other. Yeah, I'm not sure what else... What other context to pick up from that opening other than those three are the main characters. It's just like... I don't know. Let's see if I can figure it out with more openings. I love saxophones. Another girl? Oh, she naked. Okay. I don't even know what year this anime started. How old is this thing? Fighting for love again. Oh, there's more characters now. All right, so they released some kind of beast? Or is those the fighters? On the <laughs> oh, wait, so they're working together? Okay, that's that is the same blonde guy, right? So then who got the girl or did she just leave? She's not even in here. I don't think I don't see her Two things happened I can only guess Okay, two things two two possible outcomes That brunette is not appearing on here She either just like completely left the party like she was just I don't know, the two guys are just over it and they didn't want anything to do with her. So there's really no point in having her in the team anymore because, I don't know, I'm, I'm getting the vibe that she's not super powered and can keep up with their adventures because they, it's called JoJo's Bizarre Adventures. There's some kind of adventure going on. <laughs> um, or worst case scenario, she dies and that's what unites these two characters again who used to oppose each other and trying to find the villain. So I don't know, maybe maybe became rival to now let's compromise and find the killer of that girl or something like that. I don't know. All right, <laughs> on to opening three. Oh my God. All right. It's mixing in some 3D models. Hot. 
hot intro. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. We got five main characters. Oh, there's one on the side though. Some extra character. Oh, there's the group. All right, all right. So that's, is that the Prema party? All right, looking over the sunset, always a very popular thing in an anime opening. <laughs> All right, they're each showing their special skills. I'm trying to understand. Okay, that one's a, a fire starter. I'm not understanding their superpowers though. So did, can they summon other beings? Is that his avatar? Is that what he turns into, or is just something he can summon? I I don't know what the plot is. The the plot's lost to me. I don't. I can't read or understand what the plot is for that opening. It's just more adventures. There's fighting. <laughs> Wait, was the blonde guy there though, or did he leave? I don't think he's in the party anymore. So something happened. Maybe they're going on their own adventure to figure out who's the killer. Or, I don't know, maybe they're over the girl now, and, uh, and now it's just... We need to save the world, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> Is that this kind of anime? World saving? I'm not quite sure who the villain is. Is it himself? Is he gonna be fighting himself? Is that what's happening in this one? All right, so I, I can only guess that they're running out of time and they have to stop the blonde hair guy. Is that why it's clock theme? They're running out of time before it's the end of the world. <laughs> I don't know. Oh God, is that going to be the thing? Is the blonde hair man just like so angry that he wants to destroy the world? Ora, ora, ora. <laughs> I'm not getting enough information from these openings to comprehend what's happening. <laughs> to make a plot. The first one. This one again? Oh, what's this? What? <laughs> is that what this show is about? It's just those two boys always fighting each other? Does this thing actually have like a solid plot or is there like a whole bunch of subplots like they go on mini adventures and they go I don't know they, they, they pull some Indiana Jones shenanigans for one episode and they help characters in another episode Is that what this is? An anime that just has like a variety of one like solo episode adventures Which is not bad not my thing entirely I want like a story build up. I can only think that in the background is just the constant is always gonna be blue hair man and blonde man. Just getting each other's way or something, or him just constantly trying to stop the blonde hair man. Alright, so this is a new cast of characters. Does he actually transform into those things? <laughs> Is he going to school? It looks like a school uniform. He's gonna get educated. All right. <laughs> He's got the gangster hair back from the early 90s or late 80s. <laughs> He's got that, <laughs> that hair. 
hairstyle. I always find it so silly, but it's so popular too. It's such a signature look. I'm wondering if this sh this anime is like a satire, like it's just making fun of action anime in general. <laughs> I like that there's some characters that are not Hulk looking. <laughs> Alright, so last season's characters are still in this adventure. Is that the villain? A female villain? Let's go. I'm for it. Does he fight for the power of love? Is that why, like, his avatar or whatever that thing is got a heart on it? <laughs> so is this like an anime where the characters don't fight for themselves? They, they get other things to do it for them? <laughs> I'm trying to follow. Break down, break down! Break down. All right, he's still in school, I guess. With that gangster haircut. <laughs> I don't know what it's called. If you guys know what it's called, please leave it in the comments below. I could probably Google it, but. <laughs> All right, a new female protagonist. She likes the other character on the left? Does that little child get kidnapped? Oh! Alright, that character's not a villain. She... <laughs> Would've been interesting, though. Unless she's got, like, a copy of herself that's a villain. I don't know. For love! Is this like a Sailor Senshi type of show? <laughs> Just stopping random bad guys? What the heck? Oh, I thought this was a repeat. I was like, oh, he must have uploaded a duplicate by accident, but this is different. Revealing the villain? This is this is so trippy. What is happening? Yeah, I think it'd just be more fun to imagine this to be more of a male sailor senshi. <laughs> Magical boy. It's in reverse. She's just done. Odd. That's the villain. Okay, that's probably the main villain of that story. Arc. Ha! <laughs> uh, there's so much to keep up. How many episodes are there of JoJo's Bizarre Adventures? New character? Okay, it looks like they wrapped up that last story, so this is a whole new adventure. A whole new story arc, let's go! New characters, new villains. Running out of time. Lots of chains. Is someone like in prison, locked up, caged by something? Is it a metaphor? Oh my god, that character looks like Rock Lee from Naruto. Helmet hair. <laughs> A lot of chains. Ooh. Something about this music makes it feel like this is more serious. Like there's a serious, uh, story. <laughs> Not silly. 
The verses. Wait. Fighting. Are we following the blonde man's adventures now? Are we switching perspective? Is that even the same character? I could have sworn he had red eyes. That guy had blue. I'm so confused. Unless he dyed his hair. Jojo's Bizarre Adventures, you are taking me for a run. I'm trying to keep up mentally. <laughs> oh, shit! Alright, someone lost an arm. I'm... I'm... <laughs> So lost right now. It's a heart. Did he dye his hair? I think he dyed his hair blonde. Or is it the other way around where he dyed his hair black? But he was naturally blonde. <gasps> does that mean that him and the other guy are brothers? The two. Bl th does that make them brothers? Are they related? This again? Oh, is it gonna be the trippy one again? It's gotta be something trippy. So is he like a crazy character? Oh, he transformed. Oh shit, here comes the trippy part. Oh, there's that purple hair. He's rocking the lipstick. I'm getting like 80s makeup vibes. <laughs> so, was he a character that was basically our ally, but then, I don't know, he cracked? Did, I wonder if he's one of the classic characters who has like a memory loss and once he remembers, he turns into a villain because now he remembers his actual goal or something. Maybe that's what it is. It's about solving the mystery of that purple character. Okay. Who's... Again? Are they updating every time there's like progress in the story? Like, oh, spoiler! We can put it in the trailer now. I mean, in the opening. Oh, is it revealing his ultimate form? Oh no, it's his ultimate form, maybe. He went Super Saiyan 3. <laughs> Whoa. Ooh, this is cool camera control. Stone Ocean. Oh, we're here traveling around the world. We're in prison? She's in prison. New characters, new story arc. Let's go! Is this gonna be like a prison break? Wait, it's focusing on girls. Where's... Where's, where's, the, where's the main character? Where's the main character? Why are we jumping characters? Oh, there he is. Okay, so he is in jail. So we set the story with this female and she eventually finds this guy. Wait, his hair's black. Why does she want to look for him? Did he like gain a reputation and she's trying to look for help? Oh, the purple hole man guy is there. So he's a good guy now. So he goes from potentially amnesiac, amnesiac. <laughs> he goes from having amnesia maybe to like being bad to good again. I don't know.
The animation quality keeps bumping up. Well, I think it's pretty cool that we get to focus on a new character. A female? Let's go! Female power! He's still wearing the same outfit from... What, two... Th Wait, what? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, it's a character he met up in, I don't know, in the earliest season. So then the blonde guy, too, was a new character. They're two different people. Okay, okay, hold on. So we lost the main character at some point. That's an interesting turn. Huh. Okay, so she's doing it out of love, then. She's trying to find him. He got lost. That star is probably, like, a sign for a gang that she's in. Okay, so all these people are just trying to find their friend, I guess. Alright, I'm gonna take a long shot in this, but... Blue-haired man's named Jojo, right? <laughs> He's back! What is happening? Do we just follow various characters? Does it not focus on one, one main character? So I'm trying to wrap my head around this story. Like, it starts with this blue hair man guy, and then it goes to the blonde hair man guy, and I'm guessing maybe they could be brothers, but he looks way too thick to be the blonde hair guy I thought he was. I thought he dyed his hair later around Tibber here. Hold on. Yeah, so I, I was thinking maybe it's still that character. It's, I don't know, it's just like, anime styles just evolved over time? Kind of like what they did with One Piece, where Nami's, like, boobs kept getting adjusted? <laughs> so, like, I'm not, is, is this him? Or is this, like, a whole new character? Because it's, it's I am so confused! I guess there's only one way to solve this mystery is to actually watch the show, but oh my god, ah, is there like a, I'm gonna, <laughs> I wonder if someone made like a compilation of clips that kind of quickened the pace of JoJo's Bizarre Adventures, because, oh god, time, I don't know, I'll have to lose sleep, if I... looks like I'm not sleeping, <laughs> looks like I'm not sleeping, I'm gonna have to like watch at least like two episodes a night or something, oh god. How many days will that be until I finish this season? All the seasons. Ah! Well, overall, this show looks pretty funny and entertaining and obviously action-packed. I am so lost in what the story is even about at all. Um, I can just... I, I'm, I'm thinking that they're all just like solo adventures or something like that and there's probably like that one subplot that drags out through the entire seasons i must i'm assuming other than that the openings were pretty banging i did enjoy the the animations between the comic style um to like you know traditional 2d and then it goes to 3d and and um the colors the colors are popping it very unique style like you you see jojo you see this art you know it's jojo's bizarre adventure so that's that's pretty neat. Tell me what your thoughts are after watching JoJo's Bizarre Adventures. Did you like it? Did you think it was too much? Did you did you hate it? Leave a comment below. And if you want me to check out other popular anime openings that I have not seen, but try to guess what they are, uh, again, leave it in the comment below. Don't forget to sub and like. And uh, yeah, I hope you join me for my live streams on YouTube uh, so we can actually interact with each other and have fun. <laughs> All right. Thank you all so much. I hope you have a wonderful, awesome day.